Bang. Needs Knives, I'm Jared, and here we have four unique rock walls that we're going to talk about. Each one is very unique. We're going to show what's unique about each one of them. We're going to go through this really, really quickly. Now, they are going to be available on the 23rd, February 23rd. I will link everything I can down in the description for you guys. Now, we'll talk about the Maverick, and we'll talk about the Magna Cut here in one second. So, this one's Kara's favorite. It's got the blue teal, but it's almost like a two-tone because it, I mean, it is two-tone, but I mean, the actual blue, it almost comes up green in certain lightings. Anyways, this one has the spiral pivot on this side and an anchor on this side. And then the clip is to match the hardware. It looks really, really good. If you don't know about these knives, these are USA made knives. And, uh, you know, there's a lot of videos on these. I have full videos on these, um, even testing the Magna Cut. So definitely go and check that stuff out if you have never seen one of these rock walls. Now, next, this one is somewhat of like an army green color. And it's got the dimples. And then same thing with the clip. I love the way this looks, and you can actually feel this. It feels like they're very deep. And then the spiral on the other side, beautiful micro milling. Plain liner on these ones. Very, very cool. Then this one I think is like for road workers because it's got the orange and black, and then it has the hazard sign for its uh, uniqueness. Black clip, plain black clip. But, oh, yeah, wait. These are kind of a gunmetal blue. If you really look at them and you're going to see it with the next one, it's more of a gunmetal blue than black. And you're going to see it right now. Look at this. It, it literally almost is like a blue. It's not really black. It's such a cool color. I, this is my favorite one by far. I love the way this gunmetal blue looks in the light. And then this one has a bullseye for the pivot. That's its unique spot. Now, this one does have something on the clip, but it's kind of hard to pick up on the camera, but it's kind of like just like a design pattern. Then we have the red backspacer and the red hardware. I think this one's awesome. Now, as far as the orange and the black one go, the liners are color or black as well, or gunmetal blue. Now, going into these, so one, the Maverick will be coming soon after right soon after the, um it, but if you want to get one you're going to have to get on the email list because it's going to be first come first serve i will link everything i can down in the description for you guys get on the email list that way you get one in order because everybody who is on the email list is going to get one before you otherwise now the next thing the uh these are like i said these are dropping on the 23rd february 23rd here in just a couple days and there's not going to be very many. They're going to go fast. These will go fast. And if you do like these plain ones, these are readily available almost always. So I'll have this one linked down in the description available right now. So I'm not sure if you can pre-order anything like that. I don't think so. So I think that as soon as they drop, you're going to have to get them. It will be linked down in the description and I will make a post on that day. Next, the Magna Cut. So the Magna Cut, if you watch the live I did with Mike, he explained that the rock walls are already done. There's nothing they can do about the, the HRC being higher. But as far as moving forward and as far as the Maverick goes, that will be heat treated between 63 and 64, which would be the optimal range for Magna Cut. Now, I have tested their Magna Cut, and I will say that it did very well. It's It seems like it's heat treated very, very, very well. Like it's, you know, the way it's sharpened, the way it deburred, all those good things, you know, was amazing. So then I said in the video that I just felt like it was a little bit softer than, say, Spider Coast Magna Cut, because at the time I had tested it against Spider Coast. So it is a little bit on the softer side. Um, which, you know, they admit now, like I said, though, that's, you know, in the future it's going to change these ones. There's nothing they can do with it. They're already heat treated. So they're, I think it's between 60 and 62 or 61 and 62. But like I said, moving forward, the new stuff is going to be 63 to 64. Now, like I said, everything will be linked down in the description for you guys. If you guys do want to get on one of these, I think they're awesome. And like I said, USA made. If you don't know about them, go and watch reviews on them. There's plenty of videos on them. I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching.